The gentleman is recognized. Mr. Speaker, I rise to commemorate the 100th birthday of our nation's, one of our nation's most revered statesmen leaders and American heroes, our 41st President, George Herbert Walker Bush. President 41 was not only a highly decorated combat veteran, but had one of the most distinguished tenures in public service in our nation's history. He lived out his own maxim that public service is a noble calling, and I would add it's only as noble as the caliber of people who answer that call. Thank God he did. My life, your life, and the life of our country are all the better for it. May his legacy continue to inspire the servant leadership he modeled, and may it remind us that being a statesman and a politician don't have to be mutually exclusive. I'm proud to have served alongside his son, President George W. Bush. I'm thinking of him and the entire Bush family today as we honor one of the most decent, patriotic, and loving leaders our nation has ever known. I yield back. The gentleman yields back. For what purpose?